What's going on everyone? It's KT Pop here, coming at you with a brand new video. I love photo cards, as you know, and I spend a lot of time buying, selling, and trading them. In this world, there's quite a lot of rules and etiquette involved. Some spoken and some unspoken. Today, I wanted to talk a little bit about some of the worst things that I've seen when receiving photo cards. The first one that I want to talk about is no sleeve in a top loader. I really started off with probably one of the worst things possible. I've uh, mocked up some little examples here. I am not using real photo cards because that is sacrilegious. Um, I've been using these like Lomo cards that you can buy online. So I've got a bunch of these zero base one ones that I like to give away as freebies. Here we go. Little example here. The photo card with a little tab on it. You pull it out and oh my God, there's no sleeve and this little tab is right there over the precious photo card. Poor Jiung, what is he doing? Why is he not in a sleeve? So, so sad. This is not good because it can cause scratching on the surface of the photo cards. These edges are pretty sharp on a top loader. They're like knife edges. You're really gonna scratch it, maybe bend it as you're getting it out, get lots of dust and shit all over it. Not a vibe. Number two is no tab to pull the photo card out of the top loader. Unlike the first one, it is in a sleeve, but how do I get it out? There's no little tab. You have to kind of bend the top loader and then try and fish it out with your fingers. I find that this can really cause bending. Bending the top loader, the photo card might get bent. It's just nice to have that little, that little tab. If I was gonna choose between a tab and a sleeve though, I'd rather have the no tab, let's be real. Number three is no top loader at all. This again, one of the worst. Look at this beautiful mock-up I made. Let's open it up. We've just got some washi tape here and a little bit of a kind of craggly looking, craggly looking? Fucked looking cardboard here. Open that up and here we go. Poor Ricky. He's caught. When I catch you, Ricky. Ricky, when I catch you, Ricky. In this cardboard with no top loader. So yeah, you can see they've just, um, well, I'm, <laughs> I'm saying this like someone sent this to me like this. I've created this monster. They've just taped it in with some washi tape and no top loader. It's between cardboard. It is gonna kind of stay fairly rigid, but there was this one time where I received a photo card and I actually got it from Germany and it came wrapped in a horse calendar not even thick cardboard. It was just like kind of thick paper that you get like in a calendar. It had like dates and stuff on it and then a picture of a horse. And I was like, and it was in German, like a German horse calendar. It was so random. <laughs> I think that's the most random thing that I've had things wrapped in. I think it's better to have a top loader in this cardboard. It still can get bent. Like, okay, I, I probably just bent that photo card now. Let's have a look. Yep. <laughs> it's just not very secure. I don't like it. Fair enough if you put it in a top loader and then tape it to the cardboard. You know, double protection. We all love a bit of uh, double protection. Use your top loaders, people. Number four is fucked up top loaders. <laughs> I guess I'll just call it that. I've got a couple of examples here of some top loaders that I've actually received from people. They are just are pretty fucked. <laughs> There's lots of tape residue. It doesn't even come off like when you scrape it. It's literally just stuck on there. And this one, I have no idea what the hell that even is, but it's white and does not come off easily. Like industrial masking tape. It seems like the kind of adhesive tape you used to put signs up. Ah, yeah, ew. And it's like got all this shit stuck in it, like hair and stuff. So if you have your photo card in here and you pull it out, what's to say the adhesive won't get on your sleeve or get on your top loader? Like it's just creating a messy situation, you know? No one needs a messy top loader. The other thing is I really like to reuse things, use top loaders that I've received to send out things and I'm not gonna send these out, you know? So these kind of just kind of go to waste and I don't like chucking things out. I like to reuse and recycle. The power is yours. Same with sleeves. Sometimes you get really ratty sleeves and yeah, it's just not nice. You want to open it up and have a nice experience and see a beautiful top loader, a beautiful sleeve, and be able to reuse them. Number five is multiple photo cards in one sleeve. I don't remember how many I put in here, but this looks pretty stacked. Let's open it up and see how we did. I'm just going to say that for every single video now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven photo cards in one sleeve. 
gobsmacked. I don't like to see this. If there's multiple photo cards in one sleeve, they will tend to kind of scrape against each other. You can cause damage getting them out the sleeve, you might bend them. The other thing is, it will stretch out your sleeves. No one wants a stretched out sleeve, you know? We wanna keep everything nice and tight and tidy. <laughs> Cause I like to reuse them. And now this one kind of looks crappy. And if you go to put in one photo card, then it's just gonna like, it can just slide out really, it can just slide out really easily in your folders if they're like half falling out. You want everything to be like nice and tight. Dust could get in if it's loose and it'll like keep moving around and maybe scrape against the plastic. Not a nice look. Number six is too many photo cards in a small top loader. Similar to what I was speaking about with the sleeves, you don't want to shove too many photo cards into one top loader either. You can already see the problem here, right? This top loader is stuffed to the brim. Let's try and pull them out. There you go. There's one of your issues. If it's too stuffed full, these tabs are not gonna do shit. They are just gonna pull away without pulling any of the photo cards out. Maybe this one will work, let's try. Nope. <laughs> so we have rendered those useless and now have two of my issues in one. Yeah, so these are really tightly packed in there. Pulling them out, you might cause some damage, some bending, all that bad stuff you don't want. Someone has stuffed a million photo cards into this tiny little top loader. Let's count how many. This mysterious person, no idea who did it. This sleeve had one, two, three, four. Big no-no. Oh fuck. That's another thing, poor quality washi tape. <laughs> and this one has three. There you go, seven photo cards. Four plus three is seven, yes. Shoved into one small little top loader. Not about it, we don't want damage. There are bigger top loaders that you can get. You can see there's like so much more space in here compared to the little one. Maybe four I'd put in there. Just um, invest in some of these bigger ones and then you can shove more photo cards in there and they won't take up so much space in your envelope. And number seven is a lack of tape holding things together. So I have a couple of examples of this. The first one is, <laughs> the first one is when the top of the top loader isn't taped shut. I've had instances where I've received a photo card and it's taped into a greeting card, but the photo card has actually like migrated out of the top loader like that because it hasn't been taped shut. That could cause problems where, you know, if the envelope does get bent, your photo card is a lot more likely to get bent with it. So what you can do is just like chuck a little bit of uh, washi tape at the top there and then that can't happen anymore. <laughs> and that falls off. The other lack of tape situation I see sometimes is when the bottom of the sleeve isn't taped together. So with this one, yeah, even as I'm pulling it out, you can see like the photo card is almost coming out like of the bottom of the sleeve. So if you pulled it out, maybe you'd pull it out and then it would come out the bottom and maybe scrape against the top loader, not a good time. So just securing that with like a little bit of washi tape on the bottom, and then you're like, good to go. In terms of putting them into sleeves, it's always better to have them going like that with that at the bottom, because then you can tape that and then it's dust free. Dust free, na 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 na. Because if you had it like this, even if you taped it up and had it in like that, you can still get dust in there. Unless maybe you put like so much fucking washi tape over it, but then you run the risk of someone having to like peel mounds and mounds of washi tape off and then bending or damaging the photo card in the process, which you do not want. So you need tape, but you need not too much tape. <laughs> I feel like all these rules are like, you need this, but not too much of this, little of this, less of that, more of this. So these are some real life examples of things that I've seen while receiving photo cards. I know there are plenty more and you might have seen some things that I haven't seen. So please let me know in the comments down below. I really wanna do a video where I show you guys how I like to package my photo cards. So please look out for that one. If you enjoyed the video, please consider liking and subscribing and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye. Fuck, I've just been saying random shit. Please consider liking and liking and subscribe. I'm not trying to sound stressed. That's gone blue. I didn't even notice that it didn't say recording, so. <laughs> oh, this is the one that I bent the first time we filmed it. <laughs> it's still fucked. Let's just try and get something this time. I don't know. <laughs>
don't know what I'm doing. This is the stodgy one that's not even really like part of the, the theme. Mm. I really love a cruiser. Has happened straight away. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've just called this one fucked up top loader. Top loaders. Not that there's something that I'm supposed to say. It's my video, I say what I want. You tell them, kid. Some of these sleeves that I've used are really fucked. Put them straight back in there. <laughs> no. I'm just breaking all my own rules here as I'm trying to like sort these out. 